As his dad dropped him off at the kids club one morning, he told Peck, do your best today. My best, Peck thought. He'd already packed the healthiest snack he could. To top it off, Peck gave his dad the warmest hug before he left. How else could I be the best today? Peck wondered. At the kids club, Peck joined a game of tag. You're very fast, Peck told Allo. Then he turned to Sandy. And you are even faster, but I'm the fastest of all. After their game, it was mindfulness time. They got comfortable and took some deep breaths. Rhea sighed. I feel so calm now. I know, Cody agreed. I feel much calmer than I did before. That's great, Peck added. But I feel the calmest because I took the deepest breaths. His friends looked at each other, confused. Soon it was time for Rhea's birthday party. They all sang and had cake. Did you know I'm older than you? Peck asked her. I think I'm the oldest one here. Everyone stopped eating their cake and looked at Peck. They were a little puzzled. It doesn't matter who's the oldest, Allo said gently. Peck spotted that Rhea had a notable ribbon. It said, Best Birthday Kid. Peck wanted to feel happy for her, but he kind of felt frustrated. He wanted to be the best today, but there was no way he was capable of being the best birthday kid. It wasn't even his birthday. Peck knew it was unreasonable to feel upset about that. Instead, he focused on being the best at everything else. He flew his kite higher than his friends. He painted a remarkable rainbow during arts and crafts. It's the brightest and the prettiest, he said. Finally, it was snack time. Peck excitedly said, Want to see who brought the healthiest snack? Peck, we're kind of worried about you, Allo began. You are acting really competitive, Sandy added. What's going on? Oh, Peck explained, I'm just trying to do my best today. I thought that being the best meant being better than everyone else. Doing your best is important, Rhea told Peck, but it's also important not to compare yourself to others. Sometimes I feel competitive too, Sandy said, but I remind myself that even though I'm not the fastest one today, I'm faster than I was yesterday, and that's what matters. You're right, Peck replied. I couldn't fly my kite at all at first. Now I'm really good at it. And you're a great runner, Sandy. Afterward, they all played track and field games. Peck laughed during the long jump because he had the shortest jump of his friends. I don't mind, Peck told them, because I know I did my best. <laughs>